What's up, everybody? This is Eric from Media's Computer Solutions. So you got your Galaxy S10, 10e, 10 Plus. And one of the things that uh, Samsung took away is a notification LED. But you know what? This is Android. It's always workarounds. So let me go ahead and show you guys how to enable a notification around your camera in this video. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready. Ooh, look how beautiful this phone look. Ooh, look how sweet. And follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. And as you can see, I'm getting a lot of notifications and emails and stuff like that. And this is how I got my notification light going on on my Galaxy S10 Plus. All right, so let's get into it. Go ahead on and open up an app uh, that's called Always On Edge Edge Lighting. This is the app you need uh, to download to get this to work. All right, so uh, when you open up the app, uh, it's going to greet you here like this and click here for settings. All right, so when you open this up for the first time, you got four boxes here. It requires permissions from your device. So each box that you check off, you got to give it permission. You got all, you got app restriction. And right here, they say, allow this app to run without restriction. That's going to be very important right here. All right, so as you scroll down, it has a lot of settings here has a lot of settings and uh, so you can play around with it if you like, but uh, I'm gonna go over my certain settings. All right, so how to start, uh, as you can see, I got mine's automatic, always, anytime I lock. And you can click on anyone you want. Uh, right here, when notification comes in, always, on or off, right here. And I have a reminder for eight seconds, for every 30 seconds, uh, my LED notification is gonna go off. Oh, that's dope. Oh, that is dope. All right, so as you scroll down, you're gonna see something that says important. Uh, when you select this, it has every app that's on your device. And you could customize it with either the edge lighting or you could do the notch lighting. With every app you have on your device, me, you could, uh, I actually just enable all right there. So I just enable all for all my apps, but you can go in and you can customize every app that you have on your device for uh, specific notifications, uh, which is pretty neat. All right, so as you can see, uh, you can play around with it if you like. I'm just scrolling down here. Uh, I do have some things that's on. And again, you don't have to have this if you don't want to uh, for this to work. Now, screen orientation is vertical. All right, you can have it horizontal, however you want to do it. You can play around with it. And uh, as you can see, my settings. And right here, this is important also because lighting place, you could have it around the screen, left to right, top to bottom. I got mine's notch only, the notch. Right. <laughs> All right, so edge styles. Uh, you can click on here, whichever one you want. Uh, follow, crash, tide, stuff like that. That'll give you the style of lighting here. All right. Uh, and space between edges, I have it on medium. Device screen corners, I have it curved. And again, you could play around with it, but uh, this fits my needs. All right. And for colors, I have it three colors. All right. And as you can see, have three colors. It's dope. All right, and as I scroll down here, you got edge speed, edge thickness, stuff like that. Uh, you got preview panel, number badges. Uh, you got widget settings, uh, and you can play around with this if you like. And right here, you save it. All right, so when you save this, uh, it, it's going to give you some options. Uh, to for ad free, uh, you got to watch a quick video for about 30 seconds and stuff like that. All right, guys, so let me show you guys uh, how it works in action. When I tap on the screen, I get my always on display. All right, so that works very good. And when I tap on uh, to get a quick notification, my edge will work. Look at that. Boom. So I just sent myself a text message and my always on display. Now it shows me everything here. 
and you can make your adjustments on the app. I think this is nice. All right. So let me show you guys one more time. Let me go and send myself a text message real quick. And I want to show you guys again that it's working. Boom. Ah, oh, that's dope. And I got my settings a little different. So uh, you can play around with it if you like. But there it is. Notification on the Galaxy S10 E, S10, and S10 Plus. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the Galaxy S10 and all its glory. See you guys on the next video. Oh, that's nice. Peace.